Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Babe! Don't babe me. All right, look, Deb. Why don't you tell me she's hanging around with a drug dealer who's now out of prison? No, way! He's only just got out! She's not even been living here! Did you not think that was worth a mention? In fact, don't even bother. I'll speak to her about it. I've been to yours, nobody's there, so where is she? Yeah, good question. Well, she's got to be somewhere unless she's run away. Oh. Oh, brilliant. And when exactly were you planning on telling me that one? Listen, um... Thanks for trying, yeah. OK, see ya. No sign. She's taken some of her clothes. So she's obviously gone off with this Johnny, then? Yeah, we don't know that. I know that, and I only found out about him yesterday. Listen to me. She swore to me she's only met him once since he got out, OK? She reckons he's a reformed character and he's got nothing to do with the drugs from the stag party. What stag party? I thought your dad told you. No, not that bit. I... I had to go through the whole Danny history first, didn't I? And that took long enough. So what else haven't you told me? Listen, I get that you were trying to protect me, but you, sh you should have just told me everything. You what? I didn't know she was missing when I called you. I would have. Just please go and ask Dan if Amelia knows anything. I was across this. Yeah, of course you were. Even got my dad to ring me. Only because he got to you first. I'm not just talking about Danny, Mum. I'm talking about everything. She obviously moved out for some reason in the first place. You should have just told me. I felt bad. You'd done me a favour. You let me go to Scotland and sort myself out. I put a lot of pressure on you. I would have understood. And I wanted you to do your own thing, to get your head straight, focus on you. This was not your decision, right? She is my little girl, my responsibility. Whether I'm here, Scotland, or on the flipping moon. You took that away from me and you have driven her to this. Every phone call, every text, you lied to me. I really thought I could trust you. No way, that's not Debbie Dingle all the way from Scotland because she'd have called me. Yeah, well, I didn't get that much notice myself. Are you back because of Sarah? Yeah, Dad called me. Only now she's gone and done a runner, hasn't she? What? Why? Is it because Ethan accused her? Ethan? Who the hell's Ethan? I don't believe this. Right, I might have spoken out to her. Well, have you seen her? Cos she could have a 12-hour head start here. No, but I can help you look. No, thank you. Look, Debbie... Don't pretend to be part of my family, OK? Cos you're really not. But I know we ain't had a chance... Listen, to... you destroyed my dad's marriage, so that's all the information that I need. Thank you. If you hear anything, just call me. got two seconds to get out. You better not have laid a finger on her, do you hear me? Mum, why aren't you in Scotland? Take a guess, Sarah. Hang on, you've come back for me. How did you find me? We used a tracker app, Sarah. Schoolgirl Larry, yeah? I've heard my dad's version now, I want yours. <laughs> 